Hey there, y'all kept a girl waiting. Now, which one's the prince? Aha! Hello, your highness. Congrats on your wedding. Not hitch just yet. Lady Luna Freya's groom to be here in Hammerhead. Apologies for taking so long. <laughs> you best save your apologies for Papa. Well, that makes you. Cindy. Sid's grease monkey granddaughter. Roll her in while I'm still young. Didn't your daddy tell you? She's a custom classic, not some beat up old clunker. Prince Noctis. Uh, yeah. Prince. Like they took your old man and kicked the dignity out of him. What? You got a long way to go, son. And that slack jaw's getting you nowhere fast. She's gonna take a while. Y'all get her in and run along. <sighs> Y'all heard him. Let's get moving. Right this way. Now we play the waiting game. That game? Never any good at it either. Y'all ain't never been out this way before, have you? Go on, have a look around. This'll make sure y'all don't get lost. Well, might as well make good use of the extra time. Mmm, Russian Papa won't do you no good. Whoa! They got Ebony out here! Oh, Ignis is gonna flip! Wait, uh, what's a gill? I got a feeling our money's no good here, Noct. Bet you Ignis came prepared, though. Let's ask him. Enough for room and board. A moment, Noct. We've expended the last of our funds on the repairs. I suggest we confer with Cindy. Broken down and flat broke. Adding insult to injury. Old man's in for both after charging us that much. Yeah, let's pay him a visit. She ain't gonna be ready for a while. Y'all need something? A uh, bit steep for a simple tune-up, don't you think? Oh, now I get it. This must be what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them boys a lesson. Told me he ought to have y'all take care of some ornery varmints that have been causing a ruckus around here. I'd be happy to pay y'all for your services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? Well, so much for finding an easy way out. Thanks a lot, Papa. But don't go running around after dark. The demons are liable to rip y'all to shreds. Here, this ought to be enough for a place to stay. Just between us, though, don't tell Papa. Time. Looks like we found our first targets. Ready, knocked.
Good deal. Excellent work. On we go. <sighs> what happened here? A telegraph pole's been split in two. And not just this one, either. The hell do you think did this? Hard to say. Natural disaster, perhaps? You sure? Your head doesn't have a scratch on it. Maybe a huge monster came and knocked him down. It better not be the varmint Cindy was talking about. Time. Let's get on with it. So, uh, where are we headed anyway? Nowhere until the repairs are done. Then we head for Golden Key. Then after that, we hop a boat, and before you know it, lover boy's hitched. Wait for car repairs, then wedding bells in the air. Got it. Didn't mean to do that. Hang on! Warp strike to catch him off guard! This one's just for you! How about this? Impressive. Yep. All in together now. How about this? That wasn't so hard. Kronto's barely hanging on. Here goes nothing! Hey! Yeah. Nice. Mission complete. Who could this be? Hello? Hey, it's Cindy. How goes the hunting? Actually, we just finished. That's great, because I got one more hunt for y'all. Only this time, it's for a person. Fella named Dave went off, and we ain't heard from him since. Reckon he staked out a spot in an old shack nearby. Old shack? Uh, oh, got it. We'll take a look. So, what did Cindy say? Needs us to find some Dave guy. He went missing? Not missing. Said he's holed up in that shack. this knocked get out of here you okay 
we are now. Spoke too soon. I'm going all out. Just don't get too curious. You're one to talk. Big weapon like that? Wide open. No! You ready? The game is off. Stay there! Better be done. I never miss! Farewell. Oh yeah! Hey, what about the shack over there? Hey, who's out there? Well, and look who's in here. The man of the hour. Dave, right? <laughs> Been looking for you. Didn't mean to cause you all any trouble. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them varmints. I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Ah, uh, yeah. We'll take care of it. Y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw him. Way to show some spunk. Now let's get ready to kick some tail. Huh. I've been hunting for years, but I ain't never seen dual horns with blood red tusks like those. to rest up before we set out. In that case, let's find a spot to make camp. The hunters are really out in full force around here, huh? So they're the new Crown's Guard or something? Similar, though technically a civilian outfit. They've definitely seen a lot more action than we have. Uh... Is it cool that we rock Crown's Guard outfits? Be worse not to. They made them especially for us. Even got a sweet insignia on them. In the Crown's Guard, your attire identifies you. So wear it with pride. You want to make camp? Let's call it a day. All right. I'm gonna pitch the tent.
Well taken. <laughs> Not bad. Like a father to her. Ever since they got back, Sid's been the only one looking after her. Rather more than a middling mechanic can handle. All things considered, I'd say she turned out okay. But like any girl, you just need to treat her right. Treat her wrong and Sid will stuff his wrench where the sun don't shine. Take care of the car and it will take care of us. Yeah, the car. Sometimes I wonder if we'll ever sit inside that beautiful car again. Sitting most of the day was pretty nice. Napping was even better. It's a dual horn? Yes, but not your run of the mill breed. We'd best make quick work of it. Wait a sec. What? Scared, big guy? You ought to be too. Things vicious. You sure? Looks tame to me. Yeah. Look out! <laughs> uh! Yeah! Shamu's boss! Oh, nice one! It's not over yet! <laughs> Ready for round two? Bring it! Hello, How are we? Getting by. <laughs> Nice! Now it's time to go to town! Give him hell, Mark! Like to wrap that up more quickly. Ring, ring. Hello. Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Okay. Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. She'll be waiting at the garage. Gotcha. Huh? So. Who's up next behind the wheel? Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Not sure I'd do any better. Put me in the driver's seat. 
good. Because I need the leg room and back. Only so far a man can walk. Our Crown City upbringing didn't prepare us for this. Ugh. Pretend you're walking to the car. It's rude to keep a girl waiting. You better apologize. Uh, uh, what is that? like half bird, half storm, half airship. You realize that's three halves. Well, it explain its size. <laughs> awesome in every sense. Feels so sluggish. <laughs> 